Welcome to Car Advice TV, I'm Anthony Crawford and this is the 2008 Subaru Impreza WRX. For $39,990, I reckon it represents the best performance car buy on the market today. What Subaru have created here is a car far less aggressive than the previous generation WRX in an attempt to appeal to a far wider group of buyers. And they haven't done a bad job. Apart from the bonnet scoop here and the headlight washers for the Xenon lights, pretty much looks like a regular RS. But what Subaru haven't changed is its 2.5 litre boxer engine putting out 169 kilowatts and 320 newton metres of torque. That'll get you from 0 to 100 in a cool 5.8 seconds and that's quick. But what you may not notice is Subaru have placed the engine deeper into the engine bay, lowering the centre of gravity and slightly improving the handling dynamics. What puzzles me though is why we've gone from 215s down to 205 tyres on this generation and 4 pot brake calipers down to 2 pots. Given the outstanding performance of this WRX, it's actually quite an easy thing to drive. The 5 speed manual gearbox is very fluid making shifts a breeze. The clutch is slightly heavy, but then again I expected that with the WRX. Grip is prodigious. This car will go around corners at ferocious speeds, even in the wet. But that's not surprising. The WRX, like all Subarus, is constant all-wheel drive. And that's where cars like the WRX and the Mitsubishi Evo stand out from the crowd. What Subaru have created here in the new WRX is a potent performance car you can live with seven days a week. It's wickedly quick, highly practical, but most of all, it's easy to drive. I think it's a winner.